Hello my friends, Liberty Garden, April 25th. Look at Stella, trying to come to the highway. Uh, coming to you from the farm, and today I'm kind of showing you a gate that we had installed here last week. And um, the task at hand is to, well, this is what I did last week, and I'm kind of working on, on just uh, finishing today, is to untie from this small brace the fence that came to this brace, I'm untying it and putting it on this brace. So that's been done, nice and tight. There. And then on this side, the same way. I got, uh, I have a brace on this side that's a railroad tie and a little six inch post and a, and a pipe so I untied that and I tied it here uh, the fence looks uh, here it's pretty tight uh, this T post looks a little bit crooked I might just have to un undo it and just make it straight because uh, it leans in a little bit when I when I move the fence a little bit inside it's no big deal I might just leave it like that to keep the fence tight and uh, that's it uh, it's a nice, uh, this is 7 inch pipe, and uh, this is, uh, I think it's uh, 2 and 7 eighths, or 2 and, yeah, 2 and 7 eighths, I think. This is what this pipe is. I need to paint it. And the guy was nice enough to put my, uh, my last name initial in here, so that was a little bonus he threw in there, so that's awesome. And this is square piping. I guess it's 2 inch square pipe, or 1 and a half inch square pipe. And uh, this is a cattle panel that he welded on the back because there's a quite a big gap in between the end of the sign of the fence. And uh, so then cows don't get out, there. there's a cattle panel there. And that's it. Uh, right now I'm going to work on removing those old braces, salvage whatever I can, mostly the wire. This uh, high tensile wire is pretty good. So I'm gonna salvage that and the center pipe and uh, the post quite frankly I think I buried these posts in uh, concrete so I'm not gonna I'm not going to try to take them out I'm just gonna chainsaw them to the ground and that's it